In this problem, we're given the function f of x equals 3 times the absolute value of x minus 3, and we're being asked to find f of x plus 3. So when we're doing that, x plus 3 is going to be the input to our function f. So any place there's an x in f, we're going to replace it with x plus 3. So for this one, we're going to have 3 times the absolute value. Now here's our new input. So our input goes in as x plus 3 minus 3, close our absolute value. Those 3's, the positive and negative 3 cancel. Our final answer will be 3 times the absolute value of x. The next problem is very similar. This is our input for our function. So we're going to put that in for x. So this one will be 3 times the absolute value of 2x squared plus 3x minus 4 minus 3. And then we'll simplify to have 3 times the absolute value, 2x squared plus 3x minus 7. Close our absolute value. doesn't matter what goes in those parentheses. It just tells us that that's what the input is. For instance, if I wanted to find f of star, that tells me I'm using my function f with star as an input. So it would be 3 times the absolute value of star minus 3. So we have to realize that whatever's in those parentheses is our input.